So Sally is divided into two sides. On one side is right and left loop, and on the other side is Mouse Branch and Thompson. And today I'm writing the left loop. Uh, they alternate days so that horses and hikers can use the alternate routes. And going straight here will take you to the right loop. And then the left loop has a bit bit of a qualifier climb here, I would say, to, um, to give you a sense of what's going to be involved in riding the trail. ridden over here for a long time and I've never ridden it on my e-bike so I'm kind of interested to see how it goes about a little over eight miles. About 65 degrees, early April, North Carolina. Rollers.
one time I was riding this, the right loop. I was the first person on the trails in the morning, I camped, came around a blind curve, and there was a skunk right in the middle of the trail. And I had maybe, maybe six inches to get around him. I was almost certain that I was going to get blasted, but I didn't. First uh, two or three miles of left loop are really nice, fast and flowy. Uh, some uh, fairly decent climbs, but uh, mostly downhill, I'd say, and it's just a real blast to ride. As it uh, turns more inland away from the reservoir, uh, the climbs get longer and steeper, but then so do the downhills. garden. Lots of little creek crossings. Shale. So as you can see, uh, the first part of Left Loop parallels the Fontana Reservoir, yeah, so you get some really nice yeah. views as you ride along the edge of the water. And I do mean the edge.
Love it. The combination of the e-bike power and the long suspension uh, allows this thing to just roll right over roots on uh, steep pitches like that. Brakes are wet. I'm about to get wetter. <laughs> I'll let you get by. <laughs> well, I'm Have a beautiful day. Thanks, I'm 77 years old. <laughs> So this guy was um, obviously much younger than me, riding a regular bike. I'm on an e-bike, and he is already in the process of dropping me. And this is a, a really steep pitch that we're on right now. The GoPro uh, kind of levels everything out, but uh, but we're climbing pretty good pitch, and he is he is really cranking it. I caught up with him a little bit right in here. But, uh, but then he's off and gone, and, and by the time I get around the curve here, he's pretty well dropped me. Hey, I'm cheating. I'm on an e-bike. <laughs> I didn't edit this out because it was an amazingly steep section. It uh, doesn't show nearly as steep as it is on the GoPro, but uh, then right over the hill it turns into a very nice section of downhill. As you can see, the better part of the left loop trail is on bench cuts. As you can see, the majority of left loop is uh, on bench cuts, and I got to say, some of them don't allow a whole lot of margin for error.
bridge. These things are slippery when they're wet. You're good. Thanks. On your right. Thank you. Uh, on your right. Thank you. Loose rocks on a steep pitch. Always entertaining. This was a really steep downhill section, uh, especially the top of it. But once I got around uh, a couple of these little minor turns, it was just a great ride downhill. back. How do you like the e-bike? You know, this is my first ride on it. Oh, really? Yeah, I've got a, a Yeti 4.5 that I just dearly love. But I'm 77, almost 78. <laughs> and I got when the... I'm 77, I hope I'm out here doing <laughs> Yeah, I got to thinking the other day, hmm. <laughs> Maybe an e-bike. Like <laughs> I'm 50 and I'm happy. <laughs> well, so yeah, I actually have a a channel on YouTube if you're interested. It's called Old Guy and a Yeti. Okay. And I post my rides on there. Yeah, so okay. I'm I'm recording this, so you guys might just be on there. Okay. Cool. <laughs> so yeah, it's uh, my goal is to encourage older people, especially to to mountain bike, because there's no exercise quite like it, you know.
this is another extremely steep pitch and it goes on and on and on. This is actually what they call the county line road, which uh, takes you from the end of left loop back down to the trailhead. So it's about a two and a half mile section. Most of it is uh, gravel road, some um, single track as you see here. bike is a tremendous help on hills like this, but I tried to keep it in one of the lower power settings so that I still got a good workout. So you can probably tell from my breathing that I'm cranking it pretty good getting up this one. It was really steep. Apologies for all this loud clicking. It's not the bike. It's something on the the uh, GoPro harness or my pack. So I've got to try to figure that out because it drives me crazy too. So I apologize for that.